Welcome guys to this new video text press. Today I'm going to be showing you in a little bit of easy way how to add reviews with your website. You can build trust and credibility with your actual audience. So it's going to be really easy guys. The very first thing you want to do is to have an actual site into Google Sites. So I'm going to leave you the link down below in the description or just go directly into sites.google.com and you can get started with an actual website totally for free. So in, inside here, you can always go for the blank side or you can go into the template gallery. The template gallery is going to be helping you to get started with an actual website totally for free using, uh, let's say the features, um, the bundles, blocks that are already by default then included in those templates. It's going to be much more faster to you to create an actual website. All right, now the first thing we wanted to do is to go start with an actual website that we already have. Now what we wanted to do is to add some reviews directly inside this actual website, right? So the next step is to add an embeamed code. Assuming that I wanted to add something like this, you wanted to go into elfsite.com. Inside Elfside, you can do a lot of stuff, a lot of widgets, but you have to consider that, of course, there are a few stuff since this is totally for free. We're only able to add one template, one widget at a time. So make sure that you choose one wisely. For example, assume that I wanted to add this one. I'm going to continue with this template. And here, what you wanted to do is to choose the shows or the business address you wanted to get started with. So you can add this widget directly into your website. If you do have an actual website, in this case, it's going to be uh, the Google Sites. I'm going to head back. I'm going to go into three dots and go for um, view my published site. It's going to be asking me, of course, to sign into an actual account. So the very first thing I wanted to do is to choose my account. And you can see that here we have the actual source. Here is an actual layout. In this case, I'm going to go and look out for the grid. This is the part where you wanted to customize the embedded settings. So here into the reviews, as you can see, here's the review style. Uh, the review shows the style and you can customize it if i click into customize you can show the author name you can show the author picture the verify budget uh review sources show images show lines and so on and on and on now here into the light bows and i'm going to go for something like this for the accent color if you wanted to add like a background color you can do it there is a uh with a textile section i'm going to go back here and lastly here is the actual setting in this case i'm going to use enable the english language and that will be actually it so now you wanted to go here and to published inside here you want to make sure that you choose the free version as i just told you the free version only gives you one widget 200 views and a limited uh, website to add it so if you want to go start with an actual basic plan, you have a limited website, you have a limited views, three widgets, I would not front. So I'm going to go on only for the pre price. What our customer says, I'm going to just leave this like that. Actually, it looks really great. And you can see that automatically it's going to be changing or checking out the actual AI generated summary. Now I'm going to go back into my store of the Google, of course, and look out for the embedded code. I go for paste the in-beam code that was provided for us from outside and go for next. Since my actual store does not have any reviews, I'm using a Starbucks. So as a reference, so you can see how it's going to be looking when you actually have some reviews. So I'm going to hit now into done. I choose my source, which in this case is this one. So if you already have an actual store already been listed here into Google um, Maps, then you can go directly into show, go into embeamed and mapped. You copy the HTML file and you paste it in here so you can see that the sources are going to be added automatically. And you can create an actual widget and go into published. Once again, the actual plans only gave us a one free widget. So I copy this code and I do exactly the same thing here. Copy and paste and go for the insert. And you can see that automatically is gonna be adding the actual reviews here into our store. And there you have it, guys. Very easy how to add reviews directly into Google. Now, if you wanted to get started with adding reviews directly here into Google, then you needed to get started with the actual Google Merchant Center. I'm gonna leave you the link down below in the description just in case you wanted to get started with this great application of the Google Merchant Center because you can do so much more than only reviews. So with that being said, guys, I should have reached the very end of the video. But don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more amazing tools on how you can get started here inside the actual Google and its own verifying stuff. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Hopefully, with all of that being said, we can also see you into a brand new section of TechPress. See you next time.